Oil prices recovered from earlier losses overnight, but it might not be a rebound and could simply be markets taking a breather, analysts said, warning that crude prices could turn negative again. That's because the underlying issues with weak demand and storage running out have not been resolved, and will continue to put pressure on energy prices. U.S. oil prices as well as international benchmark Brent crude have seesawed this week. The May contract for U.S. benchmark West Texas Intermediate dived deep into negative territory earlier this week, for the first time in its history, and traded at negative $37.63 per barrel. That meant producers had to pay traders to take the oil off their hands. While the brand tumbled overnight to its lowest since 1999, at $15.98, it did not enter into negative territory. Overnight, however, the June contract for WTI surged 19% to settle at $13.78 per barrel. Analysts attributed that to tensions in the Persian Gulf as U.S. President Donald Trump threatened to shoot down and destroy Iranian gunboats if they harass American ships. I'm not even calling this a rebound. I think oil prices are taking a breather, Vandana Hari, founder of Vanda Insights, which provides analysis on global energy markets. WTI last traded at $15.66 per barrel on Thursday afternoon, a far cry from levels around $60 at the beginning of this year. As it happened, it's not really managed to prop prices up too much, she told CNBC on Thursday, referring to the U.S.-Iran tensions. I think the geopolitical tensions element, at this point to the markets is extremely small.